when we sit down to watch an episode called Free Ren the Slayer, I mean, we're in for some good times. I feel like this is exciting. I like I saw that at the end of last episode, it had like a glimpse of what the next episode's title was going to be. And I was like, shit, <laughs> this is going to be cool. So, um, yeah, I'm excited to jump into this. I hope you guys are as well. Uh, please make sure to support the video if you can, liking, commenting, subscribing, and my Patreon account is in the description below. If you want to watch the full-length reaction, you can with me on there. You just sync it up with your own footage. You can enjoy the entire thing with me there. So, uh, anyway, without further ado, let's jump into episode 8 of this wonderful show, Free Ren. Stronger than Aura. Here we go. <laughs> Oh shit! Oh my god. She's quick. Yeah. That's crazy she reacted that fast. Oh! She's still holding on to it! Haha! <laughs> Oh, that's so good. <laughs> yeah, fuck you, dude. Oh, shit! Holy shit! Oh, my God. God damn, man. Wow, we saw her properly fight. That's sick. <laughs> That's great. How can you take such a small bite of a burger? <laughs> it's gonna take you ages to get through that. Maybe it won't. She's chomping it down. Did she finish it? If you guys wait like 20 seconds, you'll probably see her. Oh god. Oh. <laughs> She's gonna make fun of you? No, she isn't. Good. Good job not making fun of him. She doesn't want it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> we have to remember he's a scared little boy. Yep. Uh, escaped is a strong word. <laughs> oh shit. Mm -hmm. That's true. Oh my god, this guy's smart. I don't expect leaders to be smart. <laughs> this is refreshing. Don't get manipulated by their words again. But also don't die. Oh shit. He's gonna use a blood demon heart. Oh! Holy shit. Oh, this is sick. This is so cool. Oh my god, this is stressful. Oh! Holy shit, man. Oh no. Oh this is bad, man. Well, free run's coming. They're definitely gonna be pardoned and safe after this. Is that her? Yes, it is. <laughs> that was good that she was able to figure out it was her. Mm -hmm. So you couldn't prove that it was him. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> That's an understandable thought. Like, we gotta leave. Oh. I don't know if they can beat the head demon. But that's true. 
I think they're strong. I just don't know if they have the experience. <laughs> That's funny. Fleden's little smiles are so cute. She's so proud. What the? Whoa. Oh, your aura? Cool. <laughs> this show is definitely less peaceful now, you know? Which I don't mind. I like some action. <laughs> Stark is not having a good time. Holy shit, man. She can just fly, right? Yeah, I was gonna say. Nice. Sometimes it's little, little things like that that make all the difference with a magic user. Like she has just a little bit of telekinesis, you know? That's impressive. Wow. All oh, right. That's right, that guy. Okay, and is this like a blood magic? That's beautiful, man. Just a rainbow on her eyes. Not rainbow, but you know, the beautiful colors on her eyes. Oh, is that a little barrier around the plant to protect it? <laughs> um, nope, there's not. So, sorry. Bye. This, this leader, like the human, is, uh, is actually kind of awesome. Oh, God. They wouldn't hold back with the torture either. They have literally no humanity. Is this... Yes! That's okay, this is your new son. It's okay. Don't worry, man. Just cut him. Aww, yeah, it's good that you're fighting through your... Your fear. Oh. Really? Even if you just take it from him? <laughs> Do it. Oh shit. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, shit. oh, shit. oh, shit. oh thanks! But he's not looking at him. <laughs> Doesn't even see him as a threat. Oh, shit. This is great. Oh, no. Oh, no. But this is awesome. But, oh, no. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, Stark. This is so hype. Great. Oh. Oh shit! Fern's here! <laughs> oh! Holy shit! That's so satisfying. Look at her! That's right, she she's not easy to detect. They've said that about Fern. <laughs> Oh, did you? Oh my gosh. Okay. Both sides kind of want to retreat to heal up. Oh shit, can you track it? And it's effective. <laughs> oh, shit. Freer in the Slayer. <laughs> that, oh my god. Than anyone else in history. I, oh my god, man. 
Hold on. The Japanese line there said so so no free ren. Isn't that the Japanese name for the show? So this show in Japanese isn't titled Beyond Journey's End or whatever. It's titled Free Ren the Slayer, is it? Okay, so I've just I've just put it into uh Google Translate. Um and so so <laughs> means funeral the so so like the so so kanji that they use means funeral um and then it has the i guess the direct translation it has here uh on wikipedia is free in the final farewell to the dead so i like I, I is i guess i have a i have some questions <laughs> is did he say so so no freedom at the end there and so then was he calling Frieden, like is, is her nickname in Japanese more closely like Frieden the funeral or something? Um, but they, you know, they made it sound like as badass in English. And so they call it Fr Frieden the Slayer here. Um, I don't know, but uh, I'm, I'm definitely curious because it sounded like they had a title drop there, but obviously it doesn't, it's not a title drop for us because they're not going, she, her name is Free Rent Beyond Journey's End, you know? Um, I just put away my notebook, and I don't know why. I have notes in there that I wanted to read off of. Um, cool. Well, that was an awesome episode. I mean, like, I... I think I remember people saying, like, that the show starts Slice of life -y and and does turn more action-y later. Um, and... But like I, you know, I was I was fine with either way. If this whole show was like slice of lifey, that would have been very nice. But also now that they're like putting some cool action magic stuff into it, that's very nice because I I love shows like this. This seems just this just feels like every sh decision this show makes makes me happy. I really really enjoy it. Um, I liked the like just the start little fight with Drat is was very simple and and great to show how how powerful free run was um and also to show how powerful the demons are because even though free run like owned him like she still admitted that she wouldn't she couldn't deal with the wire you know like the the wire would have cut through her magic eventually you know and so that's pretty terrifying like even even this guy who was like bottom of the rung um still like if Freeran didn't do anything about it or he had a, a bit more of a safeguard um then she would have been screwed you know um i there was a line there that i liked and i couldn't comment on it in the episode because it would have taken too much like explaining and analysis but i did really like it he said something like would we like because she was like ah oh, that idiot by she i mean the um the young demon the uh, you know, the female demon that we've got here. Um, she said like, oh, that idiot, he underestimated her. And then he, Lugna said something along the lines of, um, uh, where like the executioners of Aura the guillotine. Do you think that we would die just from underestimating someone? And I think what that line means is like, it, it, like, we're so strong that us underestimating someone isn't enough to, like, offset, like, enough of a, um, <laughs> of a, of a difference in, in a regular battle with a human or with a, with a mage, you know? Like, we should be so much stronger than a mage that we can underestimate them all day and still shouldn't it still shouldn't be a problem, which means this mage is actually a problem. I think that's what he, he meant in that short one line, and it's a, it is a cool line nonetheless. Um, I also liked the town leader in this episode. He was very cool. Um, just give me a sec. Okay, sorry, I got an email and I wanted to check it. Um, it, it I thought it was an important email and it ended up not being an important email. Um, so, uh, the town leader was was very cool. I, I like him a lot. He had some good lines. I liked that he was like, he talked about his son a lot, obviously, in this episode, in the previous episode, but also when he was talking to Stark about how his his hands shaking was actually like valiant, like that was a good thing. Um, that was 
that was like just really a really cool nice thing to say and i like how he how quickly he figured out the demon's shit like he was like hey look we found hey the the mage escaped and there's a guard dead down there huh so strange and then the demon's like mm, yeah weird okay and he's like oh and uh by the way i know it was fucking you guys because <laughs> like she was very like by her demeanor and stuff she was not the sort of person who was gonna kill a guard at any point but you guys on the other hand are um and you're coincidentally missing one of you guys you know so uh, i really enjoy that um that he sort of figured that out so quickly and was decisive about it it was great because like even though he ended up like being overpowered and losing that battle still still great that he got there in the first place um and then Stark and Fern working together was so awesome. That, like, that whole thing of, like, him fighting to distract him and then Fern lowering down and she's, like, uh, silhouetted by the moon. Like, it's so cool. Um, and then, like, the blast actually completely shocking the dude and, and you know they they did not expect that they wouldn't be able to sense fern because they said like when we first got introduced to fern i think freerun was like wow this girl is like nigh undetectable and that's that remains true like she legit can't even be detected by these demons which is fucking awesome um and then ah uh, like the thing is he at the end there was like i remember now it's Freerun. This is Freerun the Slayer, the person who's killed the or the uh, elf who's killed the most demons ever out of any anyone. Crazy thing is, like you forgot that, bro. <laughs> you forgot about like this is the most powerful mage you've ever come across, and you just forgot her. But I guess that might feed into what demons are like. They they so much are not threatened by humanity and by you know non. Uh, non-demons that uh, that even the most powerful one they've ever come across they it's just like oh oh yeah I kind of remember you you know like that's like that's disrespectful <laughs> but that I think that's the intention is that like that's why he forgot because it's like any of humanity is not even on their radar at all so really cool stuff I loved that episode um, but I've loved every single episode of this so far. Man, this is a standout show of this season, isn't it? It's so great. This is going to be a, a show that I'm going to remember for a long time, I feel like. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for joining me for this reaction. Um, I enjoyed it. I hope you did as well. Please make sure to support the video, liking, commenting, subscribing on a small channel so every little bit counts. And my Patreon account is in the description below if you want to watch the full length reaction um, or get early access for certain videos, exclusive videos, lots of other stuff. So thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.